Hello and welcome to Little Learners. In today's video we're going to be making this advent calendar. This is something that you can make with your children and it's great fun. Before we get started don't forget to click that like button if you enjoy the video and subscribe for more Christmas videos. Let's get started. To make this advent calendar you're going to need some backing. I'm using this large piece of cardboard. You'll need something to cover this with. I'm going to be using some green felt. You'll also need some green and brown tissue paper. Some tubes. I'm using some kitchen roll tubes but if you don't have any of those you can just use some card and make your own tubes. I'm going to be doing both because I don't have enough empty kitchen roll tubes. You'll also need some glue and a piece of red card or paper as well as some scissors, treats to go in your advent calendar, I'm using sweets but you can use toys or pictures and you'll need a pen. So to start off I'm going to be cutting my tubes into three pieces. As I said if you don't have any tubes you can just make your own out of card. I'm making mine to be the same size as my kitchen roll tubes because I'm doing both. Fix it together using some tape and then cut it up into smaller pieces. And just keep going until you've got 25 little tubes. Next we're going to be covering our tubes with tissue paper. We need to cover 21 of them with green and 4 of them with brown. As you can see I've covered one side and tucked it in on the other. Make sure one side is covered and one side is open. You can use glue or tape to fix it inside. Now it's time to build our tree. Place your tubes with the open side facing up. You'll need two rows of two, then six, five, four, three, two and one to make our Christmas tree shape. Oh, and top tip, if you start running out of tissue paper, you don't have to cover the entire tube unless it's on the outside. So just make sure that one end is covered. Next we're going to use our tape to attach all of the tubes together. Across the rows and up as well. And then you'll have something that looks a bit like this that can move as one. Kind of. Next we need to make our backing. Draw around your tree, just roughly, on your piece of cardboard and then cut it out. Now we need to cover our backing, so I'm using brown tissue paper on the bottom and PVA glue to stick it on. I'm then going to be using some green felt for the main part of my tree. You can absolutely use anything green for this, you could paint it, you could use more tissue paper. I'm simply using felt because I ran out of green tissue paper. Cut out the shape you need and stick it on. And now we have our lovely tree as our backing. Place your tubes so that they are open side up and fill them with whichever surprise you decided to put in your advent calendar. Now we're going to be attaching our backing. Flip your backing upside down because we're going to want to stick it on this way. Now put that aside for a moment and using your PVA glue coat the very edges of each of your tubes so that they will stick to the backing. Once that's all done, you can attach your backing to your tubes. When leaving it to dry, you might want to leave a couple of books or something a little heavier on top just to keep everything together. Once it's dry, you should have something that looks a bit like this. Next, we're going to be making the numbers for our calendar. Cut up some little squares from red paper or whichever colour you choose. You might even want to do it multicoloured and then using your PVA glue stick the numbers on. I've put my numbers in order going from the bottom of the tree but you can put them in any kind of order you like or don't put them in order so that children have to search for the numbers each morning. 
And there you have it, your very own advent calendar. Although, it does look like something's missing. Ah, there we go, a lovely star for the top of our tree. Remember, you can get as creative as possible with this. You can add glitter, you can use different colours, you can decorate it however you wish, or you can go for a more minimal tree like I have. Then, to get your treats out of your calendar, all you need to do is poke a hole in the tissue paper and pull out your treat. And there you go, it really is as easy as that to make your very own advent calendar that children can join in with and will enjoy. If you liked this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up as it really helps out the channel and if you're going to have a go at making this advent calendar do let me know in the comments below. If you do end up making one please do send me a picture of your final product you can do so on these social media platforms. Don't forget to subscribe. I wish you a very Merry Christmas. Thank you for watching and I will see you next time.